US Secretary of State Hillary Clinton has criticized Russia for sending attack helicopters to Syrian President Bashar al-Assad's regime, while Moscow has rejected the US claim. With diplomacy at a standstill, the reported shipment of helicopters suggests a dangerous new turn for Syria after more than a year of harsh government crackdowns on largely peaceful protests. Israeli President Shimon Peres has suggested the international community should step aside and let the Arab League resolve the issue. Let the Arabs do it. They are ready. Let them take responsibility. Let's not accuse anybody that we are intervening. Let us support them in any way we can. Clearly humanitarian. I don't speak about Israel. I'm not sure that they would like to have our help. We would like to help. Not by arms, but by food, by support, by voting, and by morale. And I think right now, this should be the decision. Diplomatic right hopes now. have rested on Washington and Moscow agreeing on a transition plan that would end the 40-year Assad regime. But Moscow has consistently rejected the use of outside forces to end the conflict or any international plan to force regime change in Damascus.